Welcome back to FCF. I'm your guy, Gabriel the Message, and we're back with another. Yes. Ooh, what's that? That's a Lamborghini. But we're not focused on that one, we're focused on this one. This is the Lamborghini Huracan Stirato, and it is an off road supercar. It is the first off road supercar from Lamborghini. It is basically an off road Lamborghini Huracan Evo. But do me a favor and never take your Evo off-road. That's a Technica, by the way, okay? Now you know what a Technica is. Never take your Evo off-road. You can take this off-road. It has the fog lights in the front. This is not even a review. This is just a quick, you know, overlay of the car. Fog lights in the front. It is off the ground and it has a skid plate. Skid plate. Can you see it? Yes, ladies and gentlemen, that is a skid plate for your Lamborghini. Yes, skid plate for your Lamborghini. This is to protect your side fenders from the dust and debris, and it has open bolts. I personally think that is beautiful attention to detail. It looks rugged, it looks aggressive, and it looks like it's ready to go on the ranch or the farm. I wouldn't take this like over rocks or anything because it's still Lamborghini, it's still a supercar, but it is ready to go off road. Here's another thing, 33 millimeters in the front, 34 millimeters in the back, which means that it's wider than your average Huracan and it's not for show, it's functional. So it's not just because they wanted it to be wider. It is because these are different tires. So these tires are different for the Lamborghini because it's off road and they had to give it different tires. So these aren't your standard normal hurricane tire, uh, Huracan tires, these are bigger. So they made bigger tires and tougher tires for the Stirato. Now, in the back, this is the back of the car. The king of the V10s is Lamborghini, okay? What I like about Lamborghini is they keep the exhaust looking the same. McLaren changes their exhaust. So the 765LT, the 720S, the 600, the 675, they all have different bumpers. Lamborghini has the same rear diffuser always, same exhaust, beautiful. And I wanna tell you an interesting fact. This is the firing position. So 10 cylinders, that's what the V10 for, and the V is because it is a V configurated engine. And this is the order in which they fire off. One, six, five, 10, two, seven, three, eight, four, and nine. I don't know if you needed to know that, but God darn it, now you know. And it has a roof rack on top. That is for the people who have a lot of money, but they just wanna have fun. This is functional, stay with me. LP640, I mean LP610, which is 610 horsepower, four, which means it's four wheel drive. This is functional for the dust and debris, and this is functional. And that on top is so that all the extra, like everything coming in is getting sucked into that vent and um, it helps to keep your roof clean and all that good stuff. You know what I'm saying? You would get what I'm saying because you're gonna buy a Lamborghini. This video is for you. You're about to buy a Lamborghini and you need to know the basics of it. We're gonna get in this bad boy and take it for a test drive. So get a good look at the Lamborghini Huracan, the off-road Stirato. I'll see you soon.